Alright, so the first thing I'm going to do right now, just messing with him, is I'm going to desensitize with the lead rope, okay? Um, just because he hasn't had a ton of handling, uh, he's not used to like different movements and different objects and fast movements even. He's pretty good with putting his halter on, he's not bad with that, but he's not an easy one to catch. <laughs> so, without grain that is. Uh, by this age, I think he should already know how to stand and deal with humans. So what we're going to do is just flip it up over his back. Right. So I'm going to do it a couple times, and then I'm going to rub him with it. You always start with the back in these things because the back is like the least sensitive area and then you work your way to more sensitive areas. Like I'm going to start doing it around his neck more because so that's going to get closer to his face, which is, can make him a little bit more nervous, right? Yes, there we go. Definitely when he shows any signs of relaxing, I'm going to say, good oh boy, and I'm going to stop because with that, I'm going to teach him how to get me to release the pressure. Right? Right? Desensitizing part, we can desensitize to a lot of other things, but another thing I have a, I want to do today is um, help him work off of moving off of pressure. And he does some of that right because he knows how to follow a halter. So he already understands pressure and release like that, so that helps. So what we're going to do is start by um, pressuring his body now and telling him we want him to move this section or this section. And all I want to do is just have him step over, that's all I'm looking for. So, let's go ahead and do that, buddy, okay? I tend to start on the hind quarters, so that's just what I'm going to start with. So, all right, buddy, just stand still. And if he's going to move, I'm not going to do it yet. I'm going to wait till he stops, like now, and then I'm going to push in with my fingers, start rubbing a little bit, and I'm going to increase the pressure. There, until he gets off of it. <laughs> Now he didn't really move this leg, but he moved the other one, so he's in the thought press process of doing it. So when we're teaching it in the beginning, you know, a little step is something. Now we can't stay there, we'd never get anywhere, so you have to keep increasing it. But this is where we start, right buddy? Good boy. So that was back
gonna call that it for the day with okay. them. We'll be working with them again probably later this evening and then tomorrow. Hang on, guys. Oh, you silly. You silly. Um, so I think we went over with some desensitizing with the lead rope. We went desensitizing all over the body with that. Um, we rubbed up and down their legs. He successfully picked up all his feet um, and held them up a little bit. She's pretty touchy about stuff like that. So we only did front feet with her yet. We'll work on that some more. And then uh, we did moving off of pressure and they both do that really actually very well for their age and what they've done in their life so I it was a good day it was good there you could tell they're a lot more relaxed right they're a lot more settled yeah so I think we'll call it a day all right I'll see y'all next time